and welcome back to my channel. So today we are going to be trying some unique curl 4-in-1 styler. So it's leave-in detangler, curl cream, and moisturizer. First, if you are new here, first off, welcome on my old time subbies congregation around gang happy curl gang. Welcome back, sis, for another video. I don't get along well with creams, so I'm kind of debating if I want to use this as an all in one, like it says, or do I want to incorporate my wet line extreme gel? Only reason is because I turn to the back and the back says. Okay. As the moisture level is very intense. However, the whole level is soft. It's like an in between a soft and a medium, and that's not gonna not not gonna do it for me. I think I'm gonna break out my Wet Line Extreme Gel, which is my actual you know all time favorite what I grab type of styler. I want to say this video is not sponsored. However, Unicurl or Unique Curl, Unicurl. Bro, what are you talking about? Unique Curl, Unicurl. What? <laughs> sent this to me so yeah and I also want to shout out one of my subscribers this shirt you know and it says happy curl happy girl congregation ring gang happy curl gang so thank you for that I appreciate it so I'm wearing it in this video all right so I have not detangled my hair in the shower I know that's it's not very smart. The only reason I did not use this as a detangler or I did not detangle in the shower is because it does say it's a leave-in and a detangler. So, I've never tried it, never smelled it. I don't remember if this smells like the deep conditioner. I don't think so. I think it's like a different smell. But it's like a... It smells floral, kind of, but not really. I know that makes no sense. I'm not a huge fan of the smell, but you know, it's not strong, so it's okay. This is how it's looking, and it's thick. It's, yeah, it's really thick. Ooh, it's super thick. This is thick. I didn't expect this. This is, ooh. Oh, because it's a styler, too. Bruh. That makes sense. It does have a lot of slip, which is really good since it says it's a detangler. It actually has a whole lot of slip. Take my dimming brush. Boom. Bam. Okay. Not too bad. Um, I don't use my demon brush to detangle. It was close by. So, you know, we work with what we got. Yeah, so. Yeah, so this is not going, this, this, this is not going to be a styler for me. Um, no shade or anything like that. You know, everybody's hair is different. Um, so I am going to break out my wet line extreme gel. Use this smart cream by itself on your next twist out and you'll know it does exactly what it claims. Oh, see, so I didn't see that. Hold. I am not going to apply anymore, but I will say that the moisture level is a one. Let's just see if it goes with the wet line. It should. Yep. It goes. Yeah, so it's going to weigh my hair down a whole lot because it's thick in my opinion. Like, look at that. It is super weighing my... Oh, wait a minute. It's extremely weighing my hair down, which I like. Wow, look at that. Like, it's almost straight. Um, I don't know how this is going to come out. Oh, okay. Let's just finish this up. This may not... This may not work for me. You guys know I get my roots. Like I say in every video, and I say in every video because we got new people coming through. Um, you're not going to neglect your roots. You are doing any other style, especially like a straightening style or your flat ironing. So don't neglect your roots if you're doing a wash and go. Yeah, I don't. I can already tell this probably is not going to come out. <laughs> So a trick to really help with your shingling process, this is what I've learned doing it a few times, is taking like your dimming brush or like a one of your favorite detangling smoothing brushes and kind of stopping where you can see in between. So it's kind of like halfway shingled for you a little bit. As soon as you let that go, 
you're kind of left with pieces that you're able to shingle. I just kind of stick with those. So I don't have to do too much separating. It's just like a natural shingle in a sense because the brush helped you a little bit, so. <laughs> say this my hair is like this because I just wanted to try something different so this doesn't like indicate that I didn't like my hair um just trying something different um yeah you know different feel um so let's get let's get let's 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 get to uh you know the product it's a four-in-one styler so for a leave-in I think it's a really really thick for me for a leave-in and my hair texture and then the fact that I apply thick stylers on top of that um i think my hair was a little overwhelmed but if you like thick leave-ins this is perfect as far as a detangler awesome i'm excited to try this on my daughter what makes it a really really good detangler in my opinion is the fact that it has a lot of slip this product is really thick like a little goes a long way um as far as a curl cream it's definitely a no for me but i don't think my opinion should you know influence anyone because <laughs> i'm not a cream styler i'm not a cream styler <laughs> it doesn't matter what type of cream it is it could be a cream that jesus made <laughs> Well, if Jesus made it, I probably like it. But you know, to just say Moses made it. Like, I'm not, I don't know if it's gonna work for me. Then, you know what I'm saying? I'm a gel girl. My hair likes gel. That's just what it is, okay? That's all I'm saying. As far as a moisturizer, <sighs> um, they did it again. And when I mean by did it again, their deep conditioner is amazing. For a moisturizer, oh, like I really believe uh -huh. that this will be amazing for those who live in super cold and dry climate um, where your hair is just zapped of moisture. This stuff right here will get you right. Like I said earlier, it does suggest using it for a twist out. Oh, and also it's for dry, coarse hair, which means, you know, it's for thicker hair types. This is definitely something that I would reach for when I need moisture. It just gets the job done. I think pairing it with wet line was a little bit too much. It does have an 18 month expiration date on this here thing. Okay, so be cognizant of that as soon as you open it. Okay, take the seal off. You got 18 months to use it up. My hair feels... Listen, sis, hear me. Okay, right here. My hair feels so good. I want it to be defined. I want it to be shiny. But if it don't feel good, like, it's just... No, it has to feel good for me. Um, that's pretty much it. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you were entertained. I hope you laughed. I hope you learned something. And I will see you guys in my next one.